This morning, it's the end of an era for the so-called love locks on an historic bridge in Paris. The government is starting to remove these symbolic padlocks. Some call them an eyesore and a safety hazard. Mark Phillip shows us how the relationship with the love locks turns sour. He is in London. Mark, good morning. Good morning. Well, it was a touching little idea at the start. Go to Paris, city of love, and lock it in, literally. But as so many have learned, alas, nothing lasts forever. It's official. You can have too much love, even in Paris, a city that makes a living from it, especially when the demonstration of that affection has taken the form of scratching the loving couple's names on a padlock, attaching them to a bridge, and throwing away the key. The symbolism is obvious. So is the weight. City officials say more than 700,000 locks have been attached over the past eight years, most to the Pont des Arts, a load it was never designed to handle. Sections of the railing were showing the strain, perhaps like some of the relationships. So after years of trying to politely discourage the practice by putting up signs, the Parisian party poopers moved in this morning. Not just the locks, the railings of the Pont des Arts are being removed. They'll be replaced by plexiglass. I think it's awful. Michelle and Matthew were one of many couples who came to Paris over the weekend to try to get in under the wire. A great way to show that Paris is the city of love and, you know, it's a symbol of that. Although the whole love lock thing was a mystery to some. We never even heard of the lock bridge. It was my son when he gave us this. I thought it was for our luggage. Lock bridge, luggage, easy mistake. Paris being Paris and tourists being tourists, visitors will no doubt find other ways to show their affection. Some who came thought the city should have found another way to deal with the problem. Fix the bridge and keep the locks. The locks will be kept in a warehouse until somebody can figure out what to do with them. Love's labor's lost, Shakespeare might say. In the meantime, loving couples, never to be denied, have begun attaching locks to other bridges, bridges and to the Eiffel Tower, Gail. Oh. Love will find a way. Oh. Oh, love love, love will all. find a way. Yes. Not the Eiffel Tower. I hope they find a way, though. I think that was such a sweet thing to do. I agree. And they I have to find a way to do something yeah, with them, with right? Something them, meaningful there for all the folks. There are places in Paris they could put them. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, and probably. my guess is Paris will still always be for love. Yes. Oh, yes.